What up, people? How y'all doing today? Well, times are getting crazier and crazier. Now, California and uh, New York are on lockdown completely just about. I guess the only thing they don't have is the armies rolling through the streets of the National Guard, which they said it's not going to be that way. We'll have faith that it's not. But if you think they're the only two states that are going to completely lock down the state completely and don't want nobody out moving around, you've lost your mind because it's only going to get worse before it gets better. Uh, so with that in mind, y'all remember, we're just starting up this up the ramp of this curve. And uh, we got to get to the top before we can come back down. I think the economy will be all right as much as people are trying to pray it like it's going to be all hell breaking loose, which it probably will be, but I think we'll be survive. I think we'll come back by the end of the year. That's just my thought. Next thing I want to talk about, how in the hell is it the press corps can't leave President Trump alone and stop trying to beat him over the head with everything and trying to catch him in something to where they think they can get him and smear him in some way? Come in, get your facts, ask the pertinent questions to the facts that you won't answer, clarification, and move on. Stop trying to attack the president all the time because it makes no sense in the situation we're in. Zero sense does it make to try this over and over and over again. Every day I have watched the press conference, every day it's the same ones, every day it's the same thing, and you wonder why they call you the fake news. Even YouTubers on this platform do the same thing. They don't ask them questions, but they put their opinion out and it's never a neutral opinion. Let's just get through this together. It's always, let's beat him over the head and move on. Not everyone, but there's one or two of you and you know who you are. With that being said, my poor girl, Christine, she's got some issues. If you don't know who she is, She's what I call my 2015 Kia Soul, green in color, more of a lime green. I like her. Everybody else seems to like her. But I think we got some fuel line issues that I can't fix to the first when I get a check coming in. Not from the government, from the military. So get some of that. Whew. And all in all, life has took some crazy turns, but we're going to make it. I will survive. I will carry through. I will par I will prosper through all this somehow, some way, because we have no choice. Please remember to keep washing your hands. Keep staying active inside, even though you're inside. <sighs> I need some good things to watch. So Y'all, let me know. I found out that I found out that I could watch the Last Boy Scout on Demand. If you've never seen that? It's a great show. I also found out that I could rent. Band of the Hand, which if you've never seen that, is a great freaking movie. It makes my top five. If you've never seen it, it's freaking awesome. Well, it's hot. It's 85 degrees. It's a bright and sunny day. And uh, though I'd rather be out making money since she's down right now and really can't function, I'm going to carry my happy butt back inside the house where it's a heck of a lot warmer. And there should be food cooking by now. Hopefully. Maybe. If I'm not doing it later. All in all, keep up the spirits, folks. No use of getting down. Like I said, it'll get to work. It will get worse before it gets better. But we will survive. We will pull through. And because we actually have no choice, this is something that's got to happen. Just keep positive. Keep pushing forward. And y'all have a great day. Wash your hands thoroughly. Keep your hands off your face. And uh, hit the like. Subscribe. Please comment. Oh, look. I touched my face. It's because the freaking hair keeps messing with me. With that being said, y'all have a great, 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 great day. Please follow me. Y'all have a great day.